when I think about TV and film IP, it's definitely very different from working with a celebrity or an individual or an athlete. Uh, and I think you know the main reason it, why is because the celebrity or the athlete's a person, right? They are they're a human being who you know lots of people view them as a brand, and they are, but. They, they know themselves, they know their brand, they know their audience better than anyone in the world, uh, and they get very passionate about the projects that they're working on, can get very involved in the process. You know, on a TV film or a film property, you know, it's, there's a ton of passionate fans to your point, and you're not starting from zero, which is super helpful, but there might be, you know, four or five Star Wars games that come out, or four or five Marvel games that come out, and you wouldn't really ever see that with a celebrity or an individual, because, to get that authenticity that we're talking about, to create the partnership that we really want, the celebrity is getting involved super early in the development. You know, they're, you know, for example, like when we did the Demi Lovato game, you know, the, the team came down and they saw her in concert and they went backstage and they got to see what that was like. And, you know, she's part of the writer's room and she's come up with stories and she's giving unique insights into her life and what it's like to go on tour with her because that's what the players of the game want to experience. They want to know you know, what would it be like if I went on tour with Demi Lovato? And, and to create that authenticity, the person who knows it best is Demi Lovato. 